Unlike the national general elections, the LLG elections has been calm and orderly in this part of the country. About 180 police personnel were dispatched to 135 polling sites and 22 counting venues to police the area and defuse tensions if there are any. Five uh, mobile squad personnel will be deployed in Pomio as response unit and 10 will remain here. They will be uh, as response unit to cater for Kokopo district, Gesell and Rabaul district. So a total of 180 uh, police personnel have been deployed for this LLG election in Eastern Britain province. Unlike in other parts of the country, there weren't any pomp and ceremony during the nominations or during the polling, and there were no reports or interruptions during the counting. Those who have criminal intention to interrupt this uh, uh, election, LLG election, not to do, because we are on alert. As I've said earlier on, I've deployed as an entity man already on the field, but for, for other uh, manpower, we will be observing and monitoring this election. Like in previous elections for the third tier of government, those who ran for election stood on popular promises, such as improving basic service delivery and improving law and order in communities. Many voters are still skeptical if this year's LLG elections will bring noticeable changes compared to previous years. We are planning something for government service in order to install a remote area like a road. Polling may have ended yesterday and counting began with a few winners already declared in most parts of the province. While the process may seem peaceful for now, by tomorrow or the day after, things could turn out differently. Edwin Fidelis, National MTV News, Kokopo.